This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Man, if I keep forgetting things, I'm gonna not going to be able to get into the Museum of Natural History. Greetings and salutations, viewers, while we're back here with another episode of Parasite Even the last episode. We started Disc 2, we went through the subway system, and then we found out the goo was heading towards uh, the museum. We have to head that way, but before we do that, I forgot one item, and I, I was like looking over my notes, and I realized... That box I said looked like an item and then I couldn't grab because I thought it looked like an item is an item. I just missed it, like, or I didn't either click on it the right way or something like that. So, yeah, that is a, that is a chest. I thought it was. So, there it is. And anyway, it's the M203-2, which is basically the 203 grenade launcher, just the second variation on it, which has the uh, heat ability on it, which will uh, probably dump that off for now. And then, uh, um... Actually, I might dump... Let me look at my ammo really quick. Oh, I've almost hit the max, so... Because you can only... Uh, despite all the ammo we're getting, you can only carry 999 uh, ammo, which means, you know, any ammo we get afterwards, we'll lose. So, not that I really need to do this, but I'm probably going to go ahead and dump, like, I don't know, like... 500 ammo and just dump it at Wayne's um, and then we'll head on to the museum. I need to dump a few things anyway. I guess I could have done that off screen but with the next area we're going to go to we're going to get a lot of uh, um, we're going to get like a lot of drops so I want to make sure to clean out what I can. Uh, I'll probably take off the rocket launcher too although I might save the rocket launcher maybe for like the finale or something like that just to show off what, what it can do. Because I do want to show off what the each weapon can do, you know, like when I showed off like the shotgun and grenade launcher and stuff like that, just to show it off once. I guess I should have kept like maybe I'll should, uh, keep that like fire one just to show what the fire ability does. Same with like because I think I've already showed acid, and we'll I'll show tranquilizer eventually. Um, actually, we get more ammo. I guess where's my day? Maybe it's after certain major areas it does that. So. Yeah, more medicine for those who maybe are running out. So, all right. I don't think I had any junk, did I? <laughs> got no junk with you. You ain't got no junk. Um, okay. Let's see. Where is ammo? Oops. Move. Hmm. I thought I could just, uh,. Oh, there we go. That's how it, it, you have to reload it. That makes sense. <laughs> I was like, oh, how do I do that again? <clears throat> I was forgetting there for a second. Luckily, it gets exponentially faster after a certain point. So, all right, let's dump that off. Let's dump the rocket launcher off. I won't dump, dump the crate mainly because the next area we're going to go to has a um, more rocket ammo. Spoilers. Um, okay, so let's set that. And then items. Um... Let's see, and I still, I still have to keep these, don't I? Let's see. No. Nah. How about the warehouse key? Okay, so at least I could dump that. I know we're going to get a lot of medicine here in the next area, but so I'll dump one of those. Actually, let me dump a couple, a couple of the tools. Actually, I could probably dump all the tools for now. Because I'll probably have to come back to Wayne eventually during this, uh, during this area, just because of how much stuff's going to get dropped. So... All right. That'll take care of us for now. Yeah, good old Wayne, dropping off all our legal, legal firearms. Because technically, like all the weapons we're getting are licensed and registered, right? So, and the fact that A is just grabbing them and breaking them apart or whatever, she's—I I, guess—in America, technically, she's breaking the law by not registering every new uh, gun she gets or or whatever because uh, in America I don't know how it is in other countries but a lot of guns are serialized so they can be uh, tracked and uh, where's the museum uh, there it is the Chocobo Museum the Museum of Natural History um, but yeah all guns in America are serialized so unless they're talking about black market ones or whatever so they're tracked and their sales are tracked and pur uh, through purchase and stuff like that so it's a bit of a headache if you just want to own a firearm but you know it's for if the gun or ballistics is used in a, you know, um, event, then they can track it. So to, uh, you know, check and see if you actually shot it, that, all that type of stuff. So they have a, a general lead. So, but anyway, we're here at the museum of natural history. What the, 
That white coat. Who's that? Who's there? Well, I mean, it looked pretty obvious to me, but I don't even think we can get up to the next floor. No. And uh, we'll eventually want to go up this way. Let's see if we can use the elevator just because it's not working. But I'm sure it'll start up again if I deactivate the alarm. I've never heard of it. Uh, is that a thing? Like, um, oh, there's a safe spot there. That elevators won't work and an alarm works off? I didn't think it worked like that. But then again, I've never worked in an actual corporate building like that before. So I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, it's indubitably quiet there. Hmm. What do all those lights represent anyway? Are those do diff are those like events where fossils have been found or different museums or I'm not sure. I've actually never been to the New York Museum of Natural History before, so oh, there's a water fountain. I'm trying to say, I, w I was seeing if there's any like descriptives. Oh, there's uh, some fossils there. I think those are fossils. I could be wrong. I was seeing if there was any descriptors you could uh, um, read. <laughs> We're just stepping on the fossils, just ruining like. Uh, Ruining it? No, I guess there's nothing to actually explore. Okay. Well, sometimes in museums they have those little plaques you can read. There was there was something like that when we went to the zoo, so I'm surprised there's nothing like that yet. Maybe there is, so. No, oh, there's a little. Does that. Oh, that doesn't say anything. Huh. I'm disappointed, game. Uh oh. Well, either someone robbed something or something broke out. One of the two. Oh, look at that big old dinosaur skull. Anyway. And here we're going to mess in three. Alright. We're probably end up starting to use those because enemies are going to start packing more of a punch later on. That's kind of disappointing game that they didn't get flavor text for reading the um, uh, little displays and everything. Oh well. I guess there's a... What the? Catch that, catch that scientist or man in white coat. Whatever. Hey! What the? Well, hey. Hey's for horses. Uh, Aya for a boss against dinosaurs. Uh-oh. Well... Oh, and I think these dinosaurs are actually weak to ice, if I remember. I could be wrong, but... Ow. Oh, nice. Anyway, yeah, they're gonna... Did you see that game, like, 3,000 experience? Yeah, we're gonna start getting, like, a ton of experience after... On this day, so we're gonna... Not so much level up, but, uh... How the hell did those dinosaurs get here? Mitochondria. Basically, this game's mitochondria is the same as if you it were in a fantasy game. It's like, why did this happen? Magic. In this game, why did the dinosaurs get here? Mitochondria. Pretty much. Anyway, with this chest, we get the P220 second version of it. So, um, But I've already got a better gun, but just for those who want. And there's really not much to like, take off of it from the stat-wise, so it's locked. Hmm. <laughs> so my one weakness, he locked the door. Or she, whoever. I mean, you probably already know who it is, but uh, let's just feign ignorance. But anyway, we can't go back through there, so we'll have to find another way around for another encounter that wasn't here before. So, what this time? What, dinosaurs and iguanas, I think? Oh, I should have I should have hasted because I got first strike. That's usually the best time to use uh, haste is when you actually go first. Ow! Uh, nope. Okay. Well, let's see if we can... Okay, I can hit... Okay, well, you now out of range, but still. Ah! Man, taking all this extra damage. Oh. Yeah, the problem with burst is if you kill the, the initial target of the attack, um, it immediately stops the burst, so you can't hit the other target. So, anyway, we get a level up. Whoa! Got nine bonus points. Yeah, I told you that leveling up and everything's going to be more intense, but the, the levels are going to take higher to get. But anyway, we get... A pretty good ability. Uh, medic, yeah, it removes all negative status effects. So now if we get, like, um, darkness or paralyze or whatever. Or I guess if we get poison, we can just detox. But if we get anything else, we can just medic it. Oh, yeah, and I think those iguanas drop. I think they're the ones that drop junk, and I think you could steal it from them, too. So something to consider. Oh, yeah, I forgot to sort that. So, yeah, we're going to have to start using medicines at this point. Um, do I need to reload? Not quite, but... Wait, did I reload and combat? Is that why? Hmm. Well, anyway. Uh, right. Oh, right. Bonus points. I was thinking for a second. Wait, what was I going to do? Yeah, well, nine bonus points. Woo! Into, into power. Ah, ah. Yeah, it's really all about the power. But, uh, yeah, we're going to start getting... I mean, even though my dodging isn't been that great, we're going to start getting hit pretty frequently at this point. Unless you're really good at it, which it is possible. It's just I'm really bad at it, so... Oh, nice. Got another their uh, uh, first strike, so let's see if we can... Oh, oh. There you go. Nice. 
very good. Um, yeah, I'll just hit you. I don't have to hit the... I don't have to burst him every time. Oh, wow. Nice. They're missing. No, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to some point go back to Wayne and drop all this off. Drop all this wonderful junk. Yeah, now that we've uh, the door got locked on us, now we're going to be uh, having quite a few encounters, so... Who knew? Museums could be so dangerous. I guess it is dangerous to learn learn things about the world and everything. Anyway, yeah, let's check in here. I only, I only skipped this the first time because we were going to have to come back this way anyway, so why not? Oh, nice uh, marble flooring. Major exhibit. Uh, uh, T-Rex picture. Don't know what that is because that's so blurred. Yeah, PS1 graphics. Aren't they great? MS4. And ammo 30. Yeah, see, even with me dumping off all that ammo, I gotta fill it up quite a- Whoa! Look at that thing. Oh, it's a T-Rex skeleton. Although I wonder, you know, how how true does the T-Rex actually look these days? Because if by the time this was recorded, um, or not recorded, by the time this game was made, there's been so many advancements on like what the dinosaurs actually looked like. Because apparently people just put bones together thinking that they fit. So a lot of the dinosaurs we are more familiar with actually don't work because, uh, you know, they didn't, because of old, old ways of testing how bones would fit and stuff like that. So, anyway, hmm. is that a rabbit? Oh, it's just a thing. Hmm. Well, anyway, let's check this thing. Looks like it's one of those, uh, teaching terminals or something like that. Oh. Okay. Um, I, oh, uh, not, uh, I know the answer. It's nine. Anyway, if we answer correctly the first time, we get a mess in three. I, I think you get, like, a mess in one or, like, a cure P or something like that if you fail the second time. It's only... Yeah, if you answer these right, you get a... I wouldn't say a crazy prize, but you get something nice. Anyway. Maybe fight more iguanas. Alright. Oh, I probably should have used haste. Oh, well. Ah, yeah, try to... Try to get to the center of a tootsie roll, or pop, on this one. Man, who knew iguanas could have so much, uh, experience? But, anyway. Alright, we want to go this way. Yeah, this is easy to miss. Let's see if I'm doing this right. Yeah, it's kind of hard to get down there, but now we got a little storage area for like all the excess stuff. Oh, there's another little uh, thing here. Alright, ammo 30. Okay, come on. There we go. <coughs> the name of the or or organelle that appeared in the first organism. Adesocene desophysate? Chlor chloroplast? No, it's mitochondria. Anyway, you get ammo 30. I think you get like ammo 15 or um, 10 if you fail it or something like that. But I don't remember every single fail state, so. Oh, nice. Uh, let's see, we got a few chests and we got some enemies. Uh oh. What's here? More dinosaurs. Ah, no, I didn't get first strike. Oh well, it's not always guaranteed, unfortunately. Ah! <laughs> Come on, man. pretty soon just to even though I have all this HP they're doing quite a bit of damage to me okay let's grab some of the items in here Can I get this there we go good defense plus one uh, I'm not sure what else also pops in here defense plus one there's a chest there offense plus one and one more chest the in suit. Um, it's okay. Um, I prefer what I've got now, but something to consider. Normal armor. Anyway, if we check over here, yeah, find a secret passage. Some secret treasure. Then we got a trading card for efforts and a tool. All right. <coughs> yeah, that one. I think I missed that one the first time too, because it's not obvious that you should check that because of the way how wonky the. <coughs> I wouldn't say the control schemes are, but with the way you interact with some things, it's easy to miss something like that. So. <coughs> Mm, sorry, I mean, uh, it's that time of year. Coldness, coldness, coldness. Sinuses and colds all over the place. I don't really have so much a cold. It's more sinus conditions than anything. Oh. I didn't think I could actually go that way. Okay, and I didn't think I could. It just takes me back. Okay, let's go down the creepy hallway. 
No, I never. Almost looks like it should. This should be like on a, on a, on the Jurassic Park. Maybe all the references to dinosaurs and bones and all that. So, but nope. We were in the Museum of Natural History, and all these things are coming to life because of mitochondria. What the? Someone obviously doesn't want me to get through this area. Well, giant scorpion, huh? Hey, <laughs> it's like he's going, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Get back off. Okay, anyway. Uh, let's see, what was the nutri nutritional source of the first organism that lived 3.9 billion years ago? Um, I think it's the volcanoes. Uh, the uh, uh, the way you're supposed to know this is from the, um, the information Dr. Clant tells you. Uh, that's how you're supposed to figure it out. So, Anyway, I got ammo 30 for that. Um, all right, time for boss time against the, the Scorpion King. God, hopefully it's not as bad as the Scorpion King. Yeesh. Okay, Ooh, nice. Get haste. Or we got first strike, so I can go haste. Um, with him, it's like that one creature. We want to try again. Ow. Well, I'd rather... Ow. We want to get to the side of him. So, he, like, we can at least get clawed. Because clawed does a lot less damage. Ow. Man, I just don't know this. Oh, well. That's how you're supposed to be going. There we go. There we get a level up. And we get bonus point. Yeah, the because the stinger, well, I didn't show off his other attack because I killed him too quickly. He can throw his stinger down and shoot poison at you, and that can detox you, but I guess I got lucky enough to not have that occur. Um, I think that's it. Like he can string us with the with the stinger, hit us with the claws. Which do obviously a lot less damage the claws do, and then he shoots out the, the purple like mist from his thing to and it, it hits in a pattern that uh, poisonous. So keep that in mind. So if you have poison resistance or um, or the whatever to be be aware of that. But anyway, more encounters. All right, um, haste. It's first strike doesn't activate all the time, so it kind of throws me off when it when I do. Um, Got a really good shot there. And, yeah, not this time. No. I thought I had him in a burst, but we usually can tell because they're highlighted if it if it works. And I'm more missing too. Might as well use those since those are the the weak sauce of the of the group. All right. Oh yeah, see, we're already we're already almost full on this thing. Man. Gonna have to consider dropping dropping some stuff here pretty soon. Can we interact with any of the oh, this is a way out of here. I was just trying to see if there's any like No? Hmm. I'm disappointed! Okay. No. Yeah. But we got like old kayaks from like ancient times, ancient tribes that probably dealt with the Well this natural history museum, so dealt with any uh, actually I think actually I think I wanna go down actually. Trying to grab everything on the first way through. And then uh and then we can go on. So yeah, obviously a, a museum of natural hits you wouldn't just have it's locked. Okay. Just wanted to show off that you can't go that way. Um yeah, it's natural history, so obviously it's gonna have different time periods. Obviously for most people, dinosaurs are one of the more popular exhibits in these places, but you know it has like ancient tribes and all this other stuff, so Anyway, we got an encounter with more iguanas. Of course. No. Nah, um, well, I mean, obviously. Ow. Oh, I only took four damage, actually. That wasn't bad. Alright. And then. Uh, ow. I had the right of his uh, health. Not more junk. More junk to put in my trunk. Aya can never have enough junk in her trunk. Never. Oh, that's good. Try to just for here. We get a the M2034 grenade launcher. Which has, I think, the ice ability on it, so. But, uh. Yeah, I'm not going to show a pick, unless it's a brand new, unique item. All these Dash 2s, 4s, or whatever, they're basically just a, another variation of a weapon we already got. So, um, we don't have to worry about, um, 
Oh yeah, I need to use a medicine on that one. Um, you know, we gotta start <laughs> dumping medicines here pretty soon. Anyway, let's uh, reload. Drop that all the ammo off since we don't need that. All right. <clears throat> hmm. Looks like a bunch of uh, ancient heads. Ah, oh, seriously, can't read these two. Boo. Huh. God, why does this remind me of Legends of the Hidden Temple? Hey, go through down the slide to the tramp, to the uh, up the stairs to the shrine of the Silver Monkey. God, I wonder if anyone remembers that show. They tried to re they tried bringing it back years ago, but wait, what was that noise? <laughs> what are you play Metal Gear all of a sudden? Uh oh. Now what? Are we dead? Is this real life? Or oh, because it collapsed. Dang it. Not good. Well then, I mean, I don't know how that affected us, but it's okay. Anyway, let's get up here. Uh oh. It's encounters with armadillos. Yeah, I think those are armadillos. Although first time I fought them, I thought they were pill bugs. I was like, evil pill bugs. <coughs> oh yeah, I got haste. Uh, their thing is they'll charge at your, they'll charge at your current location. So yeah, see. Trying to see if I can get a good burst on a couple of those. <clears throat> uh -oh. Ah! Shouldn't even got hit by that, frankly, to tell you the truth. Oh, nice. Got both of them. Because you can do that without taking any damage, but oh well. I just suck. Wow, we got a lot of. Oh, I should have. Ah, oh, I had to. I, I pressed the button so fast that I didn't realize I had three Medicine Fours. Ugh. Oh well, that's fine. Yeah, probably did them a couple of these. Um, or at least one of them. Yeah, I kind of wasted a mess in four. Oh well, not a big deal. We should be fine. I mean, the game drops like healing items like all the time, so. It's just I prefer to keep the mess in fours than I would the uh, um, mess in threes and stuff like that, so. I, I just had a bad habit of hitting all the buttons back to back there, so. And anyway, we got another one of those things over there. Let's see. I think there's a chest. Yeah, over here. Oh, a defense plus one. Very nice. We'll take that. And then I think there's another chest. Yeah, you can barely see it, but it's over here. Again, evade plus one. I think you can also get an offense from that, if I recall. <coughs> yeah, let's go down this way for an encounter. Gets the creature. A couple of creatures. Dinosaurs. Oh, right. Paste. Yeah, I gotta keep remembering to do that. I just, it, just habit, I guess. Let's see if we can get a good. Oh yeah, there we go. Nice. It's all about. Ooh boy, nice. All right, we get a, uh, we get pre-raise at this level. Um, revive when HP reaches zero. It's like revive, except I think you have to cast it first, and then it's in your, and then it's on you as a, a, a stat, basically. Um, I don't think it runs out either. I think it only I think it only activates. I can't get through here. Yeah, we get a lot door. But I think it only activates when you ob obviously die. So, um, yeah, let's, now let's just use it. Why not? Um, let's see. Oh, I'm almost out of ammo. Let's reload. <clears throat> let's see. Okay. Um, now I'm trying to remember if I remember the answer to this one. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, mitochondria creates ATP uh, ad adenosine uh, triphosphate within the cell. How much energy is this equivalent to? Um, hmm. I actually, I think it's the 2,000 volts per cubic centimeter. Uh, give me just a second. I'm gonna double check really quick on my notes. Hold on. All right, I just double checked my notes, so it's 2,000. I thought it was, but I don't know. I, for some reason, I misremembered, so I didn't want to push it without getting the result. Anyway, we get a medicine four for that, so awesome. Yeah, sorry, I, I say some. I was never a very good test taker, I'll admit, when I was younger. So can we read these? No. Okay. Uh oh. So that's what happened, huh? Yeah. If you don't, if, if I remember correctly, if you don't, do, I'm so used to going, uh, figuring out. I forgot. I think there's supposed to be something blocking the way if you don't, um, if you don't go down first. I remember, if I recall. Um, but I'm just seeing if there's any, yeah, 
anything you can check on the thing here? I guess not. Hmm. Oh well. Alright, let's keep going up. Let's see. I think. Oh, we're outside now. Ah, cool precious air. Anyway, let's uh go. Let's go up first. Oh yeah, it said uh, I can I just said can, I can either go up or down, and then you can either choose the third floor or whatever, so. Uh, so let's get this. We get a rocket. Nice. Not a raccoon rocket. Oops. I actually didn't mean to go through that yet. Let me go back down. Alright. And then I want to go down to the second floor. We'll have to go here eventually, but not, not yet. Alright. Go down to the first floor. Get a treasure here. Oh, I got offense plus one. Very nice. All right, and then we want to grab. Yeah, over here we get a tool. Yeah, easy for that one to get forget. You think, well, why are we even here? What's here? Well, there's a chest there. So. <clears throat> All right. All right, so, well, now we gotta now we gotta make it to the top. But what awaits us at the top is, uh, are we gonna find the man and uh, man in the the white coat? And what does uh, he want for us? And we will we learn a valuable lesson about the about natural history. Find out next time in the next episode of Parasite Eve. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.